to Tea Time with Maya. I'm Maya and today we are going to make hot chocolate with the Lindt Lindor candies. The first step of this is we took the Lindor little um, cylinders of chocolate and we have chopped them up. Oh, I'm about to lift it. We have chopped them up and now we are going to add them to our Le Creuset saucepan. Um, you can... <laughs> You can use any, um, you can use any chocolate. We also had this option and you can use like Hershey or any other chocolate that you want, but we're going to use the Lindor. Um, I don't know which one this is. <laughs> so we're going to get right into that. We're going to add our milk to this, or you can add water if you like, um, a hot cocoa or a hot chocolate, I think. So hot chocolate is with the milk and hot cocoa is with water. So that's what we're going to add now. You can add water and creamer or you can just add milk by itself. All right guys, so we have our milk added and so we are just stirring so that the melting chocolate does not stick to the bottom. Um, here you can add your sweetener if your chocolate was not sweetened or isn't sweet enough. And you can also add um, like cinnamon if you want like a spiced hot chocolate. Um, this is when you add it. And so we're just gonna keep stirring. Add two sticks of cinnamon. Here's the one, two. And stirring, while we stir, the flavors of the cinnamon will go into the chocolate. <laughs> Oh my, it smells so good. <laughs> this is, um, you can see that uh, a foam is coming. Oh, a foam, a foam is on the top of the chocolate sauce. Um, so you can add your marshmallows here if you like them to be softer, or you can add your marshmallows at the end of the, the chocolate when you're about to serve it. Um, so you can also see that the um, cinnamon sticks are beginning to become more incorporated incorporated into the sauce as well. Is it sauce or hot chocolate? Well, I call it sauce because it's in the saucepan. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, guys. So how do you know your chocolate is done? That is when it starts bubbling up and tries to come out of the pot. Um, that is how I've always known that the hot chocolate is warm enough. Um, so here you can add excess creamer if you have some and if you like that taste or you can um, prepare it to serve and add your marshmallows on top. So we're gonna do that now. All right guys, so we have our hot chocolate, we have our marshmallows from Trader Joe's, and I have chopped up a couple for the topping. So to get this out, we are going to use a ladle so we don't lose any. And we're going to, oops. First we're going to move the <laughs> cinnamon stick. Then we're going to use the ladle and pick up our it smells so good. It's very rich and creamy. Um, and it smells heavenly. And so now it is ready to serve. You can add a straw if you have one, um, but be careful of the temperature or you can drink it as so. So mom is going to try the hot chocolate for us. Uh, I think it's super hot. Yeah, good luck with that. It tastes really good, Maya. It's super hot. But you have to give some I more detail think... than that and facial okay. expressions. And... <laughs> detail is what sells it. You can taste the peppermint, you can taste the cinnamon. Um, not really a huge fan of marshmallows, so she I was trying, trying to... She's yeah. dodging them. <laughs> I was dodging them. But, uh, but uh, it's how super... is the texture, the consistency? It's, it's really good. Um, but I'm not a super hot chocolate fan. But, but it tastes really good. This is a really good thing to do if you are a family like ours and your advent calendars were filled with lint chocolate or your stockings were. <laughs> and after Christmas, you are learn that you have a lot of lint chocolate. And you want to force people to eat them. <laughs> <laughs> so that you don't still have them in February. So this is a good little... Hey, you can use them for Valentine's 
Wednesday. Yes. <laughs> Just hide the snowman. Uh. <laughs> so I hope this video was helpful. Please like, share, subscribe, and press the bell for notifications. Bye, guys.